Balls, this and that. But I'm back. So I... Oh, oh, see, see, already, I'm back. But you know, we already have this, like, crap going on in the background. I don't know how good the noise cancelling is on this phone. But you have the water heater going. Psh, psh, making motorboat noises like um, I had to do on the beginning of last stream. But that being said, like... It's unfortunate I had to cut the last stream because we had a whole 27 people in the... It was like, it was blowing up, you know, 27 people. And now, who, who knows if I could ever regain that again. If people are going to tune in and people already forgot about me in the past five minutes was the shortened attention span because of TikTok and YouTube shorts. I don't hold it against them. I just had to pick a quick phone call up from my father. But yeah, that being said, you know, we have, we have this, like, water heater going on in the background, and I don't know why, the water in this house is so cold all the time. So many problems with the warm water. I'll take showers at the gym, you know, but, um, uh, it, it is what it is. But, take two, did I get fired at work today? We're going to be discussing about that. Nova X, you'll, you'll regain it, bro, you guys. Thanks so much. Roy Royal, what's up, Rice Ball? Yo, Royal, hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. Um, uh, but yeah, you know, I was just talking about um uh, on the last stream. So what time is it now? It's one oh four. So you know we might stream for one hour and one hour and a half, something like that. Agio, hello, Rice Ball. I hope you didn't get uh fired. Hey, I don't know. This is we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna be talking about that in today's stream. Did Rice Ball get fired or not? Leave what you think happened in the comment section down below, in the chat down below. I'm too used to filming YouTube videos, so I refer to the comments. But it's the chat section, the chats, and. It's just too bad it's like kind of difficult to see the chats once you like i wish what i could do is just go into the youtube analytics page open up the comment section and um uh you know just see the comments i get through the stream scroll through but it's not simple for some reason just w another one of those youtube moments where they make everything complicated but it is what it is don't want to talk too ill about the the what like the the hand that feeds you know uh dip the root that i hope all is okay in japan bro yeah you know no problems you know i just got a call from call from my dad you know uh danny kilgore yo man don't end the stream like that i got scared yo welcome back Mag mugsy and we're back you already know Bali music king who are you so for those who don't know my name is rice bowl and i run what's called the rice bowl channel i just do what i eat in a day videos talk about my life over some like basic cooking talking about my work history i worked at 10 places in the past 10 years we've talked about maybe 30 percent i went over maybe 30 percent of the stories about all that whole situation but anyways that's who i am and during these lives people People leave comments i talk about my day i talk about my life interact so if you're new consider subscribing to the channel it's free leaving a like by pressing the three buttons on the top corner i learned that trick from watching one of those scam streams and you know if you don't want to that's okay also but that's who i am um uh, that's who i am bali music king Hi, it's me. How's your day? Would you ever do a meet and greet? I don't know, because, like, I don't know. What, like, what would I do during a meet? Like, what would I do in a meet and greet? If I was, like, selling... Nah, see, I don't want to sell anything, though. I don't know what I would even do in a meet and greet. Just give high fives, because, like, I'm just a regular guy. I'm not a talent. I'm not a musician. I'm not a sports player. I just talk about my day and tell my stories, you know? I guess we could do, like, little high fives and take pictures. I don't know if anyone wants a rice ball picture. Write my name on your shirt. But other than that, you know, it's like, I don't know what we would do during a meet and greet. Maybe if... I was a more interesting personality if I did a podcast, got a host of the show. Welcome back to the host of the Rice Bowl podcast. And then we got we get like three people and we do a live podcast action. Like if if I could get like a Kev Jumbo, Wong Fu Production, Niga Higa, Wombo, Wombo Combo going around, you know. But right now I'm just one guy in front of the camera talking about his day. Uh, Cheeky Kiki, I think he got promoted to CEO. Nah, never. it's never going to happen. Uh, Agio, CEO, Rice Bowl for the what? Nah, yo, you guys don't understand the degrees of separation between me and the CEO. From what I understand, there's... Okay, wait, I'm from... from C, we could say C... Well, it's not a publicly traded company from what I know, so... Like, the most important guy, then there's the... This guy over here, then there's the... Another guy, from what I understand, and then there's the factory manager, who's like the most important guy at the factory I currently work at, and then my boss is on the same level as the factory manager, and then I'm below. So there's one, two, three, four. Four degrees of separation from me to the top, so it's not going to happen. 
Momochi, 10 places in 10 years is actually cool. I say, I say 10 places in 10 years all the time, but is it actually the case? Transportation company, receptionist, McDonald's, cook, cook at a cafeteria. So cook at a mom and pop, cook at a cafeteria, cook at an okonomiyaki restaurant, um, cook at a, you know, takeout place, uh, um, research and development, quality control, um, deliver, not, how would you say it? Um, uh, moving. This was volunteer work, but still like, um, I did it moving and also, um, YouTuber, believe it or not. Anyways, uh, Christine, hi, I hope your dad is okay. I want to say you still have your job. Okay. Um, we're, we're, we're going to talk about this and don't worry. Does rice bowl still have his job? Did, why does he sound so happy? Did he actually want to get fired? We'll see. Uh, Egyo, not a musician. Okay, what about those banjo? Yo, very basic banjo skills. I, I need to practice more, you know? The Yuki Suruan, hey yo, Mr. Rice Ball, can't wait for the stories of today. I hope they're going to be entertaining enough. Bali Music King, which state is this? A. There's three countries in North America, come to find out, and my country that I'm in currently may not have a state, so. It is what it is. Uh, Christine, you're very cool. You're very cool. Okay, I don't know about that. I don't. Yo, JC, how's it going? Twenty. We got 27 people. Okay, 33 now. And it's crazy. We've only been live for six minutes. And to get to 33 viewers in the past, I'd have to stream for two hours. But it's nice to see people. 36. Round of applause to everyone in chat. I appreciate it so much. Tommy Vu, hey, yo, back it again for the live stream. Yo, you already know. What's up, Tommy? Hope you're doing good. Plush Canvas, bro, what type of mask did you do? just do? No, I, I was just counting the number of jobs I worked. Um, uh, Danny Kilgore, you're a Rice Bowl. Combien de views at Super Mont on YouTube? Okay, so Danny Kilgore is asking me how many YouTube views I get a month. Not much, my guy, not much. Something like 100,000. And don't get me wrong, 100,000 views is, like, pretty amazing. Just e even on short views, like, if you go on Reddit and all these little YouTube forums, you're going to be like, shorts are so easy, this and that. And it's so easy to go viral. It's all luck, this and that. But now, even it, it's hard to get views on shorts even now. Back, I think the most views I ever got on shorts in a month was 9.9 .9 million views in a month. And now we, we've decreased to literally 1% of that. But it's... It's okay, I still enjoy making shorts, and even 100,000 is like a pretty big number if you think about it, so no giving up there. Uh, Dulce Luna, hi, I hope you didn't get fired, and if you did, I hope you'd found a better job. We're going to see about that. A Ortiga, hi, how's your grandma? Oh yeah, my grandma in Japan, I think she's, I think she's, I think she's doing good. Um, I think, like, I hear she's doing good, but you know, it's like old age and all that. It gets a bit tricky, like 90 some years old. So I, I can't wait to see her there. Uh, Momochi, not boy mass or girl mass. This is rice ball mass. Yo, you already know. Paku Pak, Kathleen. Hi, I've been a fan for a while now. Yo, shout out to Papu Pak for being a long time viewer. Dip to rip that, a W rice ball. I don't know about that, you know. Soju to a straw, cool jump, mm, cool jumper. I don't know if that's some kind of um uh, slang that I'm not aware about, you know. Fever dream, I have succeeded in not missing or being late for the stream. Yo, welcome, we're only eight minutes into the stream, and I think I'm already three minutes behind in the comments. 1, 11 a.m., trying to stream every day right now, can't promise anything. You know, my life isn't that exciting, but can't promise anything. But, um, uh, yeah, yesterday's stream, I went on a whole rant, for, you know, 41 viewers, amazing, thank you everyone for watching, if you don't know who I am, consider subscribing to the channel, and make what I eat in the day videos, talk about my life, leave a comment if you have a question, or uh, some something in the chat, I'll be sure to respond. Momochi, shorts is so luck-based, like, you know, yes and no, honestly, because... There were some shorts ideas that I was sitting on and I would knew I, I just knew they would pop off. I tested them on TikTok, they did really well, and lo and behold, those are the shorts that got millions of views and carried this channel. But it's just like and then you might be like, oh rice bowl, if it's so easy, why don't you come up with more ideas? See, it's like I'm not that smart, so I, I only had a couple of good ideas, and other than that, you know, I'm just going with the flow. Uh, Muggsy, seeing you stream more than shorts. Yeah, this week we have six shorts coming up. Well, I guess Monday to Monday to Monday to Saturday, guaranteed shorts. Hopefully, guaranteed, guaranteed streams. Uh, Danny Kilgore, if you grind your three k hours, one hundred k views is pretty high. One hundred k shorts views equivalent, like one hundred k views in shorts is around one k hours, from what I could tell. So um, uh, I have to I have to supplement, and it doesn't count towards watch time, by the way, on shorts. But these vertical live streams do. So I'm on the vertical live stream grind to get this channel monetized. Uh, that's that's why I'm that's why I'm streaming so much. But I do get also, you know. But that's 
Amy Cueva, so cool to see you live. It feels more real than all the videos. Yo, that's the thing. Before I started doing YouTube video or live, sorry, I was just telling myself, asking myself, I'm losing my voice doing like talking so much every day, you know, talk seven hours at work, come home, talk too hard. But, so I'm going to stay hydrated. But I was just wondering, like, am I actually going to be able to talk to a camera nonstop for two hours and be engaging, be entertaining? And I don't know about the engaging and entertaining part, but I am managing to talk um, uh, uninterrupted for two hours. And at first I had to use my brain a lot, but now it's just becoming second nature. It could be if this was my hero academia, it could be my quirk nonstop talking. Uh, that being said, Stephen Bunn, we're back. We are back. Welcome to Take Two. Did I get fired today, guys? Nova X. Shorts is so inconsistent. I so, I, Yo, honestly, man, honestly, because... I, I basically upload the same thing every day, and sometimes it gets 10,000 views, sometimes it gets 3,000 views. I don't even know, but I appreciate every single one of the views. It might just seem like a number on the screen, but me in my heart, I'm like, wow. What, I, like, another person saw what I ate today. Um, a cheeky key kid, work, do you speak English or French? I speak French with the administration people, and then, like, um, the people in the factory I speak in was, like, the other factory people I speak was, you know, like, English and French and mix. Fever Dream, imagine all those views in the stadium or something watching it. That's the thing, like, even 100,000 views on YouTube, it's not a lot. But if you think about it in a stadium, man, that's like two, three full stadiums. AGO, I found your channel over a year ago while you are in Japan, I think. Still here a lot. Yo, AGO is a long-time viewer. I don't know how many... I don't know how many of you guys watching discovered the Rice Bowl channel after coming home from Japan. That we're still in the season two of the Rice Bowl channel. In a few in a few more months, in a couple of more months, we're going to be entering season three of the Rice Bowl channel. And then at the end of the year, we're going to be entering season four. So yeah, we still have at least um one, two exciting seasons. Season two is coming to an end soon. I don't know why I'm referring to um, stages of my life as seasons, but we still have two exciting seasons coming at least, so stay tuned if you're interested. Consider subscribing to the channel. Shameless plug, I know. Uh, Nuts says balls. Balls. Spencer, uh, Konichi Mainichi. Yo, Spencer, hope you're doing good. MJ09, you ever returning to Japan? Nothing hits like home. I'm a foreign nation national in America who works with a visa. Sometimes nothing hits like home from Italy. Yo, MJ09. Um, I'm... Plan, there are plans to go back to Japan, but nothing permanent, you know. I'm actually um, uh, born not in Japan. I speak the language fine. I know the culture, this and that. I, I used to work there also. But, um, you know, it's just hard because, you know, I'm starting to get into that age where I'm getting a little bit older and life decisions, life events, this and that coming into the mix. It's, I I wish I was like five years younger, you know. Fever Dream, I didn't even realize your shirt. That's cool. It's a Uniqlo Pikachu shirt. Watch it online. AORB. Got good news for us? Well, if me getting fired or not, depending on what perspective you look at it, from what angle, it might be good news or bad news, depending on who you are. Um, uh, yeah, so if anyone's interested in getting this shirt, I, 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 I don't know, I purchased it at Uniqlo. It's a pretty comfortable shirt. I think we got this for my brother at first, but he left it too. I don't really buy clothes for myself. Like, these pants my mom got for me because I was wearing the same pants every day. This shirt, I just ran my gra... I was at the I was at the bus stop and then I could have taken another bus but I wanted to save three twenty five so I I basically ran four miles to go to my grandma's house and it was during the winter it was all the snow I had my jacket on all that so I got all sweaty and when I got there I showered off and my aunt gave me her shirt these socks I think I got for Christmas not sure about the underwear but yeah I I, I don't really buy clothes you know uh, Max Ling what was the name of the old channel I'm sorry, I still have to keep it confidential. Watch online. Ayo, Rice Bowl. Good news for us. Let's see. Uh, Dulce Luna. You have a good stellar personality, and that is what I think will carry you to the right place. Hey, you can only hope. I don't know. It's hard to uh, do an accurate self-assessment on my own personality. Like, see me as a uh, dessert person, but hey, try to be a good person. But, you know, even me, sometimes I get tired, especially at work lately. Try not to, like, I'm not going to cuss anyone out, but, you know, sometimes, sometimes I do show cracks of frustration. But, you know, YouTube is something I enjoy doing, high energy. Sometimes at work lately, man, like... Lack of respect sometimes. Don't want to get into it, though. Anyways, Unique Hollow. Japan content gets a lot of short views. As I always say, going to Japan as a YouTube creator is basically a content farm for the views. So easy to get views when you go to Japan. But um, I don't know if I'm going to see any success this time. But we could keep our fingers crossed. Mochi. Jumper means sweater. 
Hey, that's crazy because in Japan we have a word called jamba, and it kind of means like an overcooked kind of thing. So I don't know if it comes from that. Uh, a Ortiga, do you have a TikTok? I believe views are easier there. I do have a TikTok associated with my old channel, but then I was in it got moderate success. But I was telling myself like, man. I'm not interested in TikTok. I grew up watching YouTube all my life. If I had to choose, I don't want to be a TikToker. I want to be a YouTuber. So I abandoned the TikTok channel. Christine, everyone hit the like button for Rice Ball A. Hey, thank you so much, Christine, for this call of action. Mochi, to eat food or not to eat food? That's the question. MJ09, grow the stash. Mustaches are awesome. Nah, I don't know. Like, after six days when I don't shave, I'm very, like, I feel like a different person. I feel like I look unkept and I try to shave it, you know, once every three days. Plush canvas, do you ever feel lonely? You know, honestly, never. Never. BTC live signals at Christine. Hi, yo, BTC live signals hitting his, uh, shooting his shot. The UK31, LMAO, non-stop talking quirk. What would your hero name be? The hero would be, uh, Captain Rice, maybe, I don't know. Or, um, it has to be something with talking, right? Um, Captain Parole, because Parole in French, Parole means speaking. Uh, but that being said, can you speak a few French, uh, a few sentences of French? Uh, okay. Moi, je peux parler un peu en français si vous voulez. Juste, disez-moi qu'est-ce que vous voulez que je dise. Il y a beaucoup de commentaires sur genre 3 minutes, 4 minutes, 5 minutes en retard, quelque chose comme ça, mais, um, uh... Ouais, ça c'était un peu de français. Je sais pas si ça c'est correct. Uh, quelle heure, quelle heure es-tu from that girl from the apartment? Okay, so I think I spoke enough French. This is proof that I, I'm I'm fluent in French. I did I did go to a lot of school in French. Not gonna lie, and um, uh, I just kind of lost a bit of the track in the comments. Okay, here we go. It looks like I'm squinting, and yeah, not gonna lie, because ever since I got this light, bright eyes, and it almost looks like I have a new camera. Because without the light, what? It's like totally different. People invest 200, 300. What am I saying? People invest like $2,000 for a new camera. And I thought I had to go that route also. But lo and behold, now that I know, all I needed was a new light. Christine, while well, that's French talk for you guys, yo, you already know. You already know. Um, uh, Christine, at BTC Live. Hi, so BTC Live shot his shot to Christine. And now Christine is shooting her shot back. Is there going to be something, is something going to happen in the rice bowl comments, in the rice bowl chats? Who knows? Um, uh, but if, if, if something does, keep us up to date, please. Only if you want. No stress. Bonga Apache AH-464 attack helicopter. Hi, you got Sup. I don't know if that's a slur or what. Gotta be careful reading these things without a filter, but, um, uh. Nova X, bro boy, this ain't Instagram. <laughs> Blue Skies. I was late, hope you did not get fired. I'm gonna have to talk about that. Oh man, we have 40 people in the stream right now. Could we get to 70? That would be a miracle, you know? Would 70 people stay tuned or like join the Steam to see if Rice Bowl got fired? Who knows? Uh, we need the job story. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna talk about the job story very soon. Don't, don't worry, guys. Don't worry. Kevin Millis, you good, bro? Good or not good? That's the question. Ajo, Rice Bolt, the type of man to run four miles rather than spend three. Oh, you know, it's just my values. You know, I'd rather run four miles than spend three twenty-five. I've been known to also, also run, or you know, I've been also known to run, maybe six miles going and back just to save two forty. Also, but uh, that was back in the day. Uh, Yuki thirty run Rice Bolt was the O O T D object oriented. I don't know what O T D is or so. So just through the straw. Look at. This way, if you got fired, you have an opportunity to find a new, better job. Yo, that's the thing, you know, if I if I did get fired, you know, I always hear how hard it is to find employment now, this and that. And my first job, first career job, so hard to find. It took me almost five months to find that job. And the second job, I the job that I work now, so easy, you know. And in the back of my head, I could always work. I feel like I'd, I could always get hired at a factory job, a warehouse job, a cooking job, you know. So I'm not too worried, but, you know, oppor career opportunities and progression in places like that are all next to none, you know. Uh, Deptor Rutada, waiting for the OG Japan vlogs with the conveyor belt sushi and bicycle ride. Dude, that used to be the niche of this channel. Hope I could, hope I could deliver soon so just uh, straw and if you didn't use it as an opportunity to up skills that's true maybe i have to go back to school um uh, that girl from apartment 82 what time is it there 123 that's what time it is there million uh, million dollar views rice bowl are you um rice bowl you are french nah i'm not 
I'm I'm more of an anglophone than anything. Uh, sermon, mm, sermon, and um, it's it's hard to see because you know. Okay, here we go. It's hard to see with the lights, and now the YouTube usernames are the same color as my shirt. It camouflages it. Ser sermon eats. Hi, yo, what's up, sermon? Uh, first time seeing you around. Welcome to the Rice Ball channel. If you're new, if you're not, welcome back to the stream. Christine, wow, that's French talk for you guys, yo. It is what it is. Connor Childs, W Rice Bowl. I don't know about W Rice Bowl. That girl from Apartment 82, where do you live right now? Somewhere in North America. Hey, yo. Hope you love... Mm, hoping for love in the Rice Bowl chat. <laughs> Thanks so much. Danny Kilgore. Mon chum brise le coeur des filles québécoises. <laughs> yeah, aucun fille can... Um, uh, aucune fille québécoise, man. Aucune fille québécoise dans ma vie. Uh, Chiki Kiki. Watashi mo Canada jin. Watashi mo Canada jin. dame. It all depends where you live in Canada, you know. If you. If you go to, like. I guess Manitoulin or, like, Winnipeg, Saskatchewan. I don't think you really need to know French. Even Vancouver, Toronto, Prince Edward Islands. There's only one dot in all of Canada where they're like, ooh, French. Not gonna get political though in today's stream, but um, uh, I know the French language. Connor Childs, stream is popping with rice ball. Doing my best, you know, doing my best for a nice interactive stream. This morning I was shocked though. I woke up and I had a husky voice. Like I'm losing my voice, guys, you know. But uh, everything for the stream. Stream is life. Life is stream. Dulce Luna, I'm going to bed. Hope you're still getting paid somehow. <laughs> Good luck. Okay, Dulce. JJ, hi, rice balls. I mean, rice ball. Uh, the Yuki 31, OTD equals outfit of the day. Now I know. Uh, Muggsy, it's not what you know, Burr, MHO. So just Rooster, wait, you sound like you have a sophomore engineering knowledge. You know, I, I self-studied for a solid six months. Did Python, a bit of JavaScript, um, XML, HTML, CSS, all that stuff. But uh, I didn't continue with it, but I'm thinking about picking it back up, you know, because you see money in that, you see money, the money being thrown around in that field. And I feel like the worst paying job in computer was the computers is like so much better than what I make now, you know, so. Million dollar views, Rice Bowl, you mean to fix Japanese cars? I don't, I'm not, I'm not much of a car mechanic guy, you know. Has, yo, what's up, been a while, yo, has, hope it's going well, we got the water boiler going on once again might be hard to hear but it is what it is i thank everyone for their patience and understanding that stuff like this is out of my control it's to have warm water in the house christine do you tell your co-workers not to call you unless emergency nah you know it's an open cell phone situation at this point nidia rama but but i'm going to know for next time uh nidia rama ligam hi yo what's up nidia hope it's going well uh, Karina Schneider, hi, yo, K Karina, welcome to the stream, haven't seen you around, I guess it's your first time here, hope you're enjoying the stream. Isabel, teach me something in Japanese. Okay, mm. I, I need more specifics, what, what do you want to know about the Japanese language? Okay, something about Japanese, we have three writing systems, we have hiragana, katakana, and kanji. Kanji is like the very complex ones that... Okay, no, here, I'll start. Hiragana is just syllables. Then you have katakana, which is basically just syllables that we use when writing down stuff from foreign, like, foreign lands. So, rice, if you were to write that down, gohan, kome, you could write it in hiragana, because it comes from Japan. But lingo, which is an apple, or let's say, ice cream, which is ice cream, you would have to write in katakana, because it doesn't originate from Japan. Then we have kanji, which is the syllables mixed together to make those little pictures you see ch if coming from China. It's it's all fun stuff, you know. Karina Schneider, can you say day you cool? Day you cool? Day te cool? Day anata wa kuru in three languages. JJ, I'm new at live streams. Yo, welcome back. I think a lot of people don't know about YouTube vertical live streams. If I wasn't so integrated in the whole YouTube shorts you know, network, the whole YouTube Shorts ecosystem, I wouldn't know either, I wouldn't pay attention, and I'm not here to dunk on anyone else's YouTube vertical live stream, that, but every single time I watch, it's either a Roblox gift card scam or slot machines, so I just, I'm just, I just try to switch things up, doing my own thing here, talking to a camera, basically being a, uh, not a YouTuber, a VTuber, but it is what it is, um, if you're enjoying it, consider, oh! I almost um, uh, spilled all this water on my left foot. 
see, I'm I'm becoming a streamer where you overreact over every little thing. Like that guy who started saying how streaming is the hardest job ever. Uh, Nidia Raming, uh, Nidia Rama Ramalingam, bring back the rice bowl topping challenges. I I really should, you know. That that's what got, got this channel off. I really got to get back to that. Jacob Zabihan, what's your workout routine? Today I'm going to do dumbbell chest press. Then I'm going to do pullovers, then I'm going to do inverted rows, then I'm going to do some squats, then I'm going to do some uh, knees over toe, how do you some step ups, knee, knees over toe step up, and then I'm going to do some mm, walking backwards on a treadmill to strengthen the knees because my knees are a bit weak right now, and if I have the energy I might run a bit and I might do some pitching and it's going to be it for today. Genius, yo, do you have a girlfriend? Does it look like I have a girlfriend, or does it look like I don't have a girlfriend? Uh, special announcement coming soon, maybe, I don't know. But leave a comment down below if you think it looks like I have a girlfriend, or if I don't. Uh, Momochi, Pocacho, Pochaco, huh? Momochi, huh? Raw, Sanrio, Enjoy, Spot. So, well, I don't know Sanrio, Enjoy, you know, there's Pom Pom Pudding, there's Hello Kitty, there's the Penguin, you know, I know, but I don't know if I'm a uh, Enjoy. That being said, Mr. Sloppy TF2, my cousin who passed, got his book published by my aunt and uncle. The hub, a city amongst the waste. I'm going to check it out. The hub, a city amongst the waste. I'm going to check it out. Thank you for leaving this in the... The chat, the hub, a city amongst the... Okay, I'm going to try not to forget it. And um, uh, my condolences for your... Co uh, like, you know, it's sad that your your cousin passed away. Me too, I recently lost him. Uh, so I didn't make any, like, public public announcement or YouTube video. But I recently lost someone close also. And it's not easy, you know. Just have to take it one day at a time. But uh, April Luna, watching the stream while doing my project. Hi, yo. I don't know. I don't get how people watch Rice Bowl while working on schoolwork. Like, it's amazing to me, you know. I appreciate it, though. I appreciate it. But, um, uh, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to try not to be too distracting. Agio, Rice Bowl, if you feel like it, it would be nice if you to play a bit of banjo for chat. What, that would be... I'm in the basement right now, and I'd have to go all the way to the attic. But, yeah. I, I need to... I need to get... Do I have any instruments that I can play? God, I'm tired, you know, but do I have any instruments that I can play here? I used to have a tin whistle here. No, it's gone. I really got to bring down the banjo at one point. And like I say, I only practice five minutes a day, so my skills are nowhere what you expect. But you know, five minutes a day over the course of a year... A year and two months now. It does add up. I'm able to play a few songs. I think I'm. I, I think yeah. I might be a bit stressed, you know, playing in front of a group of people. But um, it's gonna it's, it's gonna happen soon. I think. Tommy, you. Oh yeah. Whatever happened on last stream? Last stream, I I got a phone call. Like the the last one that was a four minute long stream. I got a phone call and I had to cut the stream short. It is what it is. But we're back. So you this job. Best of luck with that job. Result is gonna go, is gonna lurk. A uh, million dollar views. Rice ball, you, you are very clear speaking, well spoken, very smooth. To, yo, I don't know about that. I just, I just try to speak loud and fast just to keep everyone's attention. Uh, who's watching? Or else you're gonna scroll off and it's not, it's, it's not good for me. You know, the whole point of these. Well, I guess this whole point of the live streams is like to get the audience interaction. But if there's no comments for me to interact to, it makes it hard. So it helps when there's a lot of viewers when the chat's lit up. So I appreciate everyone who leaves a comment in the chat. I'm not a very active YouTuber in that sense, and it really makes me feel like I, I, I really need to because it, I, it's like feels good to receive comments you know you read what people have to say they might be hating they might be they might be sending a nice message it is what it is but that's the situation um uh, harman singh the answer of all of life's problems go get a poutine yo rice bowl yo, poutine is so expensive and i can't justify it because like i've never had it before and if i eat it i'm like yo this isn't good this is crap i don't want to feel like i just wasted 12 dollars so i've never had a poutine you know but uh, maybe in the future Momochi, another Sanrio fan. Okay, uh, so I don't know. I think I missed something in the chat, you know. Uh, Neil Mar Mar Matre, Neil Matre, do you watch European football? Nah, I don't watch European football, aka soccer for the American viewers. I'm a baseball guy, you know. I just watch baseball. Maxling, favorite meal ever? Probably cold udon noodles with tempura. Mocha, I love Hello Kitty and chocolate and Kittlepie. Oh, Kittlepie is probably the frog, right? Dan Kilgore, how long do you think... 
it takes to learn to write Japanese was all that calligraphy, man, I wouldn't even know where to begin, because when my brain was the most plastic, ready to absorb all the information, my brain was a sponge. Even in Japan, it takes us six years to learn, I think, a thousand characters, something like that, just to be able, I think, or maybe like 850, I'm not too sure, just enough to be able to watch the news, read the newspaper, just the basic kanji characters, I think there's like 800 to a thousand, maybe a thousand two hundred, I'm not too sure, and we do it over the course of six years, so I think it would be really hard later on in life when our brains are less, you know, receptive of accepting new information, I don't know how people do it, and it's, it's pretty amazing watching all these YouTube videos of people who are older in life talking about how they learn Japanese, what they do, this and that. I tried learning Spanish for a bit at one point, but it was a bit tricky to me. Million dollar views. I'm thinking if you had a girl, you'd be like, what me and my girl eat in a day? Maybe I don't film around her ooh, 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 to keep it private. Ooh. Uh, just middle class things. How's your grandma? My grandma in Japan, yeah, she's doing... I think she's doing well. It's hard to say with the old age, though, you know, but hopefully I'm going to see, see her soon. A Ortega, hit the three dots in the upper right hand. Like this live stream, yo. A Ortega, thank you so much for um, uh, doing the... The YouTuber, um, uh, shameless self-promotion plug for me so I don't have to. But like Ortega said, if you're interested, click the three dots right here where my finger is. I think there's three dots. Or, I'm not sure. It might be down here. I'm not too sure about the layout. And if you could just press the like, I'd appreciate it. Consider subscribing to the channel if you're new. If you want to be notified for new content or if you want these live streams to appear. But that being said, Harman saying, get a poutine from Costco, only $6.00. But I don't have a Costco membership. Million dollar views. I like it what it is. Ar Ar mm. Aradia Kumbar. Aradia Kumbar. It's my birthday, yo. Happy birthday, Aradia. Um, uh, Aradia? Aradia? I'm not too sure. Sorry. Welcome back to the stream. If Or welcome to the stream if you knew. If you knew. Uh, strong mind and body. Strong mind and body. You're responsible. I spent all my money on alcohol like an idiot. You worry about $12. Yo, I even worry about $3, you know? Like, I, man, I don't know what it is. It might be my mindset, but even when I go to the dollar store, I feel stuff is expensive. Sometimes I see a chocolate bar for a dollar, and I'm like, man, I could go to the supermarket, and sometimes this is 98 cents, you know? 95 cents, you know? Uh, it is what it is, you know? No, it's, it's, am I frugal? Am I cheap? Or am I a mix of it two? I don't know. Egyo, judging by your shorts, it seems like you really get the best of the, uh, the two worlds by being Waishin. Since mom is always giving pizza, dad makes dope Japanese food. <laughs> Yo, I can't lie, you know, I'm just lucky that, uh, I guess I meshed into both of the cultures. I look more Asian, this and that, so even people over here, they don't really see me as a white person, this and that. So I, I sometimes I get to play the Asian card, but um, uh, it is what it is, you know, I, I like being Waishin, I like being Waishin. A uh, million dollar views. I like how he saves and he lives well. Well, I don't know, like, if he saves, but I do live well. Mostly because I live with my parents. With the wage I make right now, if I had to rent my own place, it would probably be close to paycheck by paycheck. Save a few hundred dollars here. Save a few hundred dollars there. I would have my little room and, you know, maybe not that great of an area in town. But, you know, I guess I, I at some point I'm going to have to move out also. And, you know, I have to think about that also. But, man, financially, it doesn't feel responsible. Okay. Um uh Cheeky Kiki, right. Please tell us if you got fired on the on the edge of the seat. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna take a break from responding to all the comments right now. And I just apologize for making you guys wait almost 40 minutes to did Rice Bowl get fired? So to give a quick repack recap for those who don't know. I Rice Bowl work from 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. I work in a food factory. And last minute at 9.40 p.m., I get a phone call saying there's a problem. And I go, the problem, you know, the problem has already passed. It went into another section of the factory. I see the mechanics repairing what they need to repair. It seemed like everything was under control. I stayed an extra hour to just, I had to do a little mini investigation, interview some people, look at some stuff. So I did my little investigation, put pictures, diagrams, timestamps, what we need to block, what we need to throw out, this and that. I'm like, I stayed an extra hour so I could stream in peace. I don't want to be contacted. 
Then I come home, I eat my dinner, I feel like, man, I worked hard today, you know? Another day, another dollar, it is what it is. But then I start live streaming, the stream is booming. We had like 50 viewers and like never happened before, you know? It was wild. But then I get a little text message from my coworker and it basically says, oh yeah, like, we found something. I can't give too much information because this is all confidential, but the, the boss wants us to call her or your, our boss wants us to call her tomorrow night because it's the, she's the nighttime lady. She works from 9 to 5 a.m. So I'm like, oh, oh, great. What could this be? Okay, so what happened? Did Rice Bowl get fired? Did Rice Bowl talk back? I get into work today. Nighttime lady, she comes in at 9. So I get into work today. My boss's door is closed. And my bad, I just had to burp right there. I just want to preface this by saying I have no complaints about my boss, nicest boss in the world, one of the greatest bosses I've ever had. And I've had a lot of bosses in my in my day and day it's my old age, you know, I had a lot of bosses. But yeah, that being said, you know, I asked her a question today. You know, just we got a I, I had to contact the supplier. We had a problem. So and they answered us and then I just asked her, is it okay if I answer her like this? And she kinda of like Usually she's like, woo, but she kind of seemed like a bit more serious today. And I was like, oh man, like, yo, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Whatever. She goes home, this and that. And then around eight o'clock, my other co-worker te text messages me and says, yo, we got to call the boss, our boss tonight when the, the nighttime lady comes. So the nighttime lady comes around. I'm, I'm trying to deal with like three problems at the same time. People like I, I work in quality control, right? And I'm getting phone calls saying that people are too hot in this section of the factory. I'm like, yo, what do you want me to do? I'm quality control. I don't have control over the temperature. I don't have control over the building. Thank you for letting me know. But you know, and then I'm getting all these different phone calls. So I just like, I, I was kind of rude. Actually, I had to just like stop everyone and be like, a, abruptly cut them because I had to I had to call my boss like I don't know like am I getting fired I don't know so cut to the chase we call our boss so <laughs> we put the phone like this let's say this is the phone like that and then I'm sitting all the way down here my and then my two workers are around the phone so we're just like sitting around the phone like if it was some kind of fire and we were cold let me just blow my nose for this because I'm starting to get congested again Welcome to great content on the Rice Bowl channel where he blows his nose. <laughs> and yeah, basically she tells us like, yeah, it's good how you initially dealt with the situation. And then as in like you, you asked him to stop make like producing the food and you got the mechanics over this and that. And then I cut her right in her tracks. I, I cut her off and set her right there. Nah, yo, they did that on their own, you know? No one contacted us. No one contacted us until the last minute. And they, that's them. We didn't do anything for that. And then she was like, yeah, but we didn't do the next part very well. And I can't really go too much into detail, but the food passes into a certain section and it comes out. And then we, ha we, we would have had to throw some stuff out, ideally. But I didn't tell anyone to throw anything out because based on what people were telling me it seems like the product might have been look it's very ambiguous and i can't really go much into detail but there is something i yeah like in hindsight 2020 i guess we could have done but i didn't think about it and no one else thought about it and that's fine i said okay next time we'll call you this and that and okay water under the bridge you know no ill feelings but man like it just like i, I started getting like I wouldn't say upset or anything, but I'm just like, wow, I feel like such a fool working here. Because I make $23.60 an hour. And you know, they ask for university. They give me, can we see your diploma? Can we see your grades? This and that. And then I work with people who have no high school diploma sometimes. And man, they make more money than me. And honestly, it's good. Like, it's good that everyone is making, like, good wages, you could say. But I wish I could just be making a little bit more. I don't... And it's, it's kind of like crap also, because I'm considered to be part of the administration. So I don't get any of the bonuses. Like, if you show up on time, you get 75 extra cents an hour. But I don't get that. So basically, right now, despite everyone calling me, like, calling me for problems that aren't even mine, trying to, you know, I have to chase down people, write reports, evaluation, people are all my, I don't want to vent too much, like, don't get me started, you know, but since everyone was asking if I got fired or not, hey, you, you guys are the ones who got me started, but, um, uh, yeah, you know, everyone on my back, 
And I don't even get this presentation bonus for showing up on time. So right now, basically, I make, I think, here, we could do the mass 22. I make maybe 40 cents more than the lowest people in the factory, like, in terms of pay. And I'm just like, is it worth the extra 40 cents to have to run around like a donkey all day with people after you nonstop phone? Like, no, nah, I'm not, chief. No, nah, I'm ready to peace out. Like, yo, I did... I don't, I've only been here for, what, 14 months, but peace, you know, good luck, goodbye. But yeah, that's the situation. I didn't get fired. But the thing is, um, uh, when, when my, um, when my boss was like, do you guys have any questions? I said, not right, not for now, maybe tomorrow. So who knows? I might get convocated into the office. I might, and I'm excited, you know, because I have a lot to say, you know. I have, I have a lot to say. And uh, uh, hey, for the people who are saying $23 in Japan is $12 an hour in most US cities, I'm in Canada right now or somewhere else in North America. But you know, $23, you could do the math. It's probably closer to 17 US dollars. But um, uh, yeah, recently, I'm not going to lie, this job is tiring me out with um, a lot of the stuff they're pushing on to me. And look, I don't blame them, you know, it's like you just push it onto someone out and then the work is, you know, out of view, out of mind. It's very easy. If I had the luxury, I'd like to do it ourselves. It's everything seems to become a quality control problem, you know. Indeed, there's some stuff that are quality control problems. Let me give you an example. Let's say we have what's called a lot number. When we get like, here, I, maybe I could show you an example on, um, uh, Something, do we have something here? I'm just trying to look if we... There might be a lot number on this honey. Let's see. It's hard to see. Okay, this is like one headache that like, just correcting people's mistakes the whole day. It's hard to see in the chat right here. But on top of right, like here it says, L21147, L21147. So this is what's called a, a lot number. And what's a lot number? Basically a lot number is a unique number that on the, all the different products that we like register, we note down. So if someone ever eats the product, we know exactly what ingredient was used. And then we could contact the supplier and be like, yo, your, your ingredient might've been pro contaminated, might've been tainted. Could you please investigate? And you know, like stuff like that. Yeah, I understand. But when, when people start calling me for stuff like, oh yeah, the people are too hot, so, like air conditioner, this and that. Hey, I'm an empath, like I have compassion, you know. Hey, it sucks that um uh, the company, you know, it's screwed up the heating system, but it's out of control, you know. And I tell them like, yo, I'm sorry, I there's nothing I could do. It's I'm just a quality tech control technician, but um. Yeah, that's the that's the situation. So I didn't get fired. That's the situation. But yeah, just to go back to um uh, the comments a bit, it I it seemed like I missed a lot of comments. You know, Tommy Vu, how often do you wash your water bottle? <laughs> Probably once every two or three days. A uh, million dollar views. I hit that like button. Is on the left side up. In this area, I believe, or is it in this area? I'm not too sure. But thank you to everyone. 23 likes on a stream. That's unheard of for the Rice Bowl channel. I appreciate it so much. A and W whistle. Oh, A and W is the best root beer. Ever talk about lifetime biz? I like a brief day. Like a brief day today. No, I don't know. It's a. I woke up. I ate. I went to work. I'm tired. I'm live streaming. I'm going to exercise. I'm going to go to bed. This weekend, I need to do my taxes. Yo, I'm just a regular guy, you know. Uh, sneak nine Jeep two. Hey, brother. Hope everything is good, y'all. You know, one day at a time, another day, another dollar. I just take it one day at a time. And people, people are like, whoa. How do you not have a long term plan? Even my parents worry sometimes. Like, oh, you're not thinking about your future. But I can't go too much into detail about my personal life because it was too many people like in the mix. And I don't know, my family, my work probably doesn't want me to like start exposing too much. So much unpredictable stuff happens over the years, every three year, every year, like so. I, I just stopped making plans because I, I have to adapt to the unpredictability, if you know what I mean. a and W is the best root beer day to day, yo. That's right, one day at a time. Mr. Sloppy TF2. 
two. What specs does your Asus laptop have? I'm hype about the laptop I ordered. I9 RTX 490 64. Whoa, yo, my my. Okay, you you got a beefed up laptop. I don't know if you're going to be making YouTube videos or live streaming or what. But um, no, nah, no, nah, yo, my guy, not my laptop. My laptop is um. Uh, Vivo book i5. I don't think it has a graphics card. 16, 16 gigs of RAM. I think the display is nice though, but uh, starting to get old. I bought it back in 2019. This year we're coming up to five years, so might have to buy a new laptop soon. But ah, it's pricey, you know, it's pricey. I'd like to avoid if I have to. Hama saying, do you invest in crypto or stocks? Have maxed out your TFSA yet? Nah, I haven't maxed out my TFSA. I hold a little bit of crypto that I bought back in 2016. Very, like, very small amount. Stocks, not gonna, I don't want to influence anyone. I don't want the SEC knocking on my door. I have a few stocks, but I'm mostly invested in ETFs. Momochi, I love veggie pizza. Yo, for real, that, 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 stu that stuff is good, you know? A and W whistle. Uh, a and W. I always I always read your username is A and W whistleblower, but it's A and W is the best root player. Don't forget, work is secondary to life. If you need work to survive, make sure to work that can support you. With that said, drink some orange juice, house and all that. Yeah. So today I had like a big gulp of orange juice, so my throat my throat started to feel better. But now it was all this talking, and I, I really got to stay hydrated, you know, because I really got to stay hydrated. But I ate well. I'm full of energy right now. I'm going to exercise. Have some yogurt and blueberries after. Then call it a day, I think. And, um, uh... One day at a time. Go back to work another day, another dollar. Christine, I'm half Japanese. Our elders live a long, healthy life. Hopefully. Uh, hopefully my Japanese genes uh, help me live a long, healthy life. I try to eat Japanese food. And... I don't know, I eat a lot of crap also, not gonna lie. I try to counterbalance it with the active lifestyle. How many steps did I do today? I still haven't run yet. But, um... Yeah, something like 11,000 steps. Not bad, you know, not bad. We're, we're getting back up there. Once I start running, I'm hoping to hit those 15, 16, 17,000 step days again. But, uh, I just really need to get my knees back into shape. Blue skies. Oh gosh, I only get $7 an hour. Yeah, it's all relative, right? Like... How much you get paid, how much I get paid. It just really depends on your cost of living. If you're in a place where a gallon of milk costs 70 cents, I'm sure $7 an hour gets you far. But yo, if <laughs> $7 an hour where I live, man, it's, you, I don't know, like, it, it would be tough, you know. It would be, it, it would be illegal. I think that's half of minimum wage almost. GF, you should quit. But that... That being said, you know, like, when I used to work in Japan, I was making $8 an hour around, and yeah, I was living with my grandma, that's true, but I was doing the mass, I was making enough money to live alone also, because the, the rent were, like, in our neighborhood, very cheap, like $300, something like that. And after doing the mass, even by making $1,200 a month at $8 an hour, so what is that, 100 hours, 200, less than 200 hours a month, so, yeah, less than 40 hours a week, you know, and you would still have enough, man. Uh, GF, you should quit, honestly, it's not worth the headache. Yo, I I don't have anything lined up, that's the thing. Yeah, blue skies, then again, I live in Asia. Yeah, that's the thing, in Asia and North America, it's a whole different story. Uh, the Yuki 31, damn, all that responsibility and only for $22, that's wild, man. Nah, it's a bit more now, I'm at twenty three sixty. They started me off at 22 and apparently made... They made a mistake. But, hey, I never got a refund for anything. I, I I should talk about that. You know, I don't know how much they would owe me. If a dollar, so 160, yeah, they'd probably owe me like a $200. Like, wow, maybe $2,500 if they, they really wanted to make things right. But, no, I, I wouldn't expect that from them. And, okay, I, it seems like I'm dissing my job a lot right now on this stream. Don't get me wrong. I enjoy this job. That's why I keep on going back. But lately, like, man, like, I, I'm not going to say I feel disrespected or anything, but I'm, I'm getting tired of it. Like, Cheeky Kiki, we appreciate your transparency. By the way, it feels refreshing on this platform. Yo, I have, I don't have much to hide, you know, especially, especially regarding work and salary. If I was making $75 an hour, I might be more hush-hush about it. But, um, uh, nah. Nah, not with this. Let the people know what the reality is. Let the public know. Let the streets know. Yeah, speaker truth. Yeah, Yuki31, you know what it is. Uh, 77 Icky, what is going on in Canada? Yo, in Canada, it's, it's cold right now. It's cold. 
Yo, Foggy, what's up? Long time no see. I think it's, it might be the first time I see you in the, the live stream. Hope you're doing well. Christine, just stay there until you're ready to head to Japan in a few months. Yo, that's the plan. That's the plan, Christine. Foggy, hi, Rice Bowl. Love the content. Hey, thank you so much. I reckon... I, if you're if you're the same guy, Flo Foggy Wibbit... Wait. F yeah, Foggy Wibbit, right? See all the comments, you know. Thank you so much for leaving comments on the shorts all the time. I appreciate it. Cheeky Kiki Law, my dad worked in quality assurance, and when I asked him what he did at work, he'd always say he'd had he had no idea. Okay, I could tell you what, like, very briefly, I don't work in quality assurance, I work in quality control. So you could say probably it's below quality assurance. And what I do, you know, I make sure the balance is work, I make sure the temperature is okay, we make sure, you know, everything is clean and sanitary, the building isn't falling apart, the lights are good. What else do we do? If the product is a bit light, if the product's a bit dark, or, you know, like that, the weight isn't correct, we have to check all that, do the traceability stuff, ask the questions to the people, do a little swab test, send the ingredients to the lab. You know, this is just the surface of what we do. Check the mouse traps, you know, things like, you know, the, the position of the traps, you know, make sure there's no bugs. We Man, we do a lot, you know. Working, but it is what it is, though. The UK31. Uh, high key feels unfair, saw th that it's suddenly all pushed to quality controls problem. Yeah, that's the thing, but I think it's like that at most companies. I don't know how many fellow quality control technicians watch a rice bowl, watch the rice bowl streams, but uh, it might be relatable. Sometimes I go on Reddit and then. I, I go into the food science food science subreddit and uh, read about other fellow quality control technicians, uh, you know, stories. And man, some of the stuff is pretty relatable. Like seeing the, if we block stuff because we can't send it to the customers, sometimes you see production having a meltdown. Like, yeah, that's pretty. Because, you know, when we start blocking stuff like that, I guess it comes between the managers. Like, the managers get less bonus, I think, if the production goes down from stuff like that because of us. But, yo, I'm sorry. I make 2360. I don't get a bonus, yo. I just want the customer to be safe, you know? So, <laughs> I just, like, okay, calm down. Breathe through the nose, you know? Try not to get into any fights. Uh, but, yeah, I would never want to become a manager or something like that. Because these people, I also saw this on Reddit, but they look like the most underpaid and overworked people I've ever seen. And, yo, that's facts. Uh, Henny Bun. Henny a bun. Well, you got you got it. They need you, and you need more than you need them. Nah, yo, I don't know about that. You know, we're all disposable to each other. Or maybe I'm more disposable because there's no guarantee that I'm going to be able to find a job next. But it, there's pr just pretty much a guarantee that they'll find someone to replace me like that. Because even when I applied, there's apparently a hundred and some people who applied, and yeah, it's like that. You know, snap of the finger. Seventy seven. Okay, I heard about this stupid rain tax proposal. I'm not, I'm not aware, you know, I'm not aware, I, I, I haven't been following the news lately, crispy, oh, crispy chicken one, does it clap, well, do it jiggle, crispy chicken, oh, does it make the ground shake, momochi, oh, I, I'm a bit behind on the comments, you know, I, I, I forgot what I, I talked about, arty choose, hey, hey, same man, just living day by day, you know, nothing better than just living day by day, because, well, I think, well, okay. Yeah, it looks like I'm, like, very behind on the comments. I'm going to have to try to, just to answer them, I'm going to have to try to go a bit faster because we're already 53 minutes in. And what time is it? 1.56 a.m. But, yeah, that being said, um, uh, hey, same man, just living day by day. Yo, you already know, man. Because uh, there's too much stuff in life, like, that could go wrong. You could get fired tomorrow. The stock market could crash. Someone steals $2,000. Oh, there's just too much stuff. You rarely get happy surprises in life, I feel. It's mostly just like, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Like, why is this happening to me right now? It's, like, not the time for that. And, uh, it is what it is, but, you know, one day at a time. Kellen Clark, much love from California, my brother. Yo, Kellen, thank you so much for watching. Shout out to the Californian and American viewers. Uh, already choose. Thanks so much, dope crewneck. You already know the Uniqlo swag. Emma, sorry to bug you, but we are neighbors and we hear you every night. Is it okay if you please keep it down because I have to wake up early and I don't want to intrude, but you keep us up sometimes. Uh, please out. Nah, Emma, that's impossible because we don't really have neighbors nearby where I live. So um, uh, funny troll though, funny troll. Or to choose. No way, that's hilarious. 
Hey Joe, running around like a oh wait, Jaden Gaming. Yo, Jaden, hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. Uh, hey Joe, running around like a donkey. A and W whistleblower Red Bull funny for all. Yo, for real, run, yo, we were yo, not just me. Like ninety percent of us at work. It's like this at any like maybe factory setting or a lot of places where people work at. Man, we run around like donkeys, breaking our back and you know, just working for the pennies. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You know, I'm grateful for the money I receive, but man, sometimes it's not worth it. Harman Sang, I see. Uh, I see B O bag behind you. Uh, you probably live near the border of Quebec and Ontario. Yo, that's a good, that's a good observation. I don't know what LCBO, LCBO stands for, not gonna lie. Uh, might be Liquor Board Ontario, I'm not too sure, but, um, uh, I have an aunt, aunt, aunt who lives in Ontario, and she probably brought us some stuff, that's why. How to at Rice Bowl, you go to the, whoa, did I just snap this chair in half from the massive muscles? No, I didn't. You go to the gym? Nah, I just trained at home. I... I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm lazy, you know, so, uh, you're not going to see me go somewhere just to work out, if I could just do it all the time, I have some weights here, we got the treadmill, we got, um, uh, slant boards, and the body weight. April Luna, are you a music enjoyer, if so, can you recommend some songs, please? Oh yeah, just so we could keep it international for all the viewers at home around the globe listening right now, if I'm going to suggest two songs, two songs. That don't have lyrics. Omens of Love by T Square and Big Country by Bella Fleck. I, I like just give these a listen right now. I listen to these two songs so much. Omens of Love by T Square. It's like fusion jazz, and then Big Country by Bella Fleck. It's kind of like it's hard to explain. It's like almost an out of body experience when you listen to it, in my opinion. But yeah, um, uh, if you could if you could give those two a listen. And let me know next time in the chat if you enjoyed them or not. They're on YouTube, you know, so. Um, uh, yeah, give them a try. They're very good. AJO, hey, I've only caught, like, three streams and so far I've heard him recommend Old Taylor Swift. Well, yo, I don't know about recommend Old Taylor Swift, but Old Taylor Swift, yeah, I have a playlist that I listen to right now. Where it's kind of like, um, old songs from, like, 2008 to 2012 that I listen to while editing videos. And, yeah, there's a few Taylor Swifts in that. Uh, Marcus Jeffrey, are you Asian? Don't feel irritated, dude. You're Asian, one of the most beautiful types of people on earth. Okay, well, I'm half Asian. What type of Asian are you, brother? Genuinely curious. Uh, Korean, he's Japanese. Um, uh... Sorry, one sec, one sec, one sec. There's something... I, I lost uh, the flow of the chat here. Yeah, so I'm half Japanese and half white. The wife side's a mix of... The white, not the wife. The white side is a mix of, you know, Canada, United States, Ireland, Germany, you know, like a lot of white people, and they're like, oh, I'm 84% Italian and 26% Australian, and this and that, kind of, kind of half, but then the other half is full-on Japanese. Uh, Alia, your eyebrows are phenomenal. Yo, a lot of people talk about the eyebrows, and I feel like they're really big, but wait, what could you do? What could you do? It's basically a rice ball trademark at this point. Every time, you know, even at work when people would draw me or draw caricatures of me or, you know, draw like on my goodbye cards at work and draw my face, you know, they have huge eyebrows, you know, so I, I'm known for these eyebrows, you know. Oosie Goosey, hey dude, yo, welcome back to the chat, Oosie Goosey, hope you're having a good day. How to, do you play any video games? Just one Pokemon showdown for 15 to half an hour a day, haven't played in the past two days though. But, um, uh, yeah. Mochi, Rust Bowl. I know I used to play Puzzle and Dragons, but, uh, I, I, I stopped for a bit now. Momochi, Rice Bowl FNAF stream one. Nah, no, no FNAF stream. I, I don't, I, I don't have the money to start getting a console and hooking that all up to stream. You know, again, I'm a low tech guy in a high tech world, so just talking to the camera to the best of my knowledge and really have to use the last of my brain cells for the creativity right here. It is what it is. Uh, GF, I was in a situation like you. Leadership tried to dismiss my research. The next morning, I bought my. I, uh, like, next, the next morning, I brought my laptop in and walked right out, had a new job, was in Syrix, and gave myself a, yo, let's go, yo, that's what we like to hear. Mochi, I, bro, relax. Yeah, J. Bush, J. Bush, game over, game over, game over. 
Frozen Shadow 007. Hey bro, hope all is well. Stay positive, and we're hoping well for you. Ace, thank you so much. You know, thank you so much. Uh, Danny Kilgore, yo, Rice Bowl, block J Bush. Okay, my bad. I just like just scrolled through the comments right now, and I I was behind, but it seems like J Bush is gone. Um, uh, I I don't mind, you know, if you hurl insults at me, uh, hate, troll, this and that, but just just if you could avoid uh spamming in the chat, just just because it decreases. See, if if it's directed at me, no problem in the world. But if just if anyone wants to hate, just just please try to avoid um uh, hating on someone else in the chat or spamming in the chat, because we're trying to have a entertaining show for the people at home, for the people, you know. So just direct it at me, you know. Uh, Bird Krabby Patty, I love your content. Yo, thanks so much, Bird Krabby Patty. Trying to make the best possible content right now. Uh, Jay, do you golf? I golfed twice in my life. Or, okay, I went to a driving range a couple of times in my life. Yo, just to, just to go back to that whole Jay Bush spamming thing, though, I'm just, my bad, I'm like 50, I think I'm like 15 minutes behind because I'm answering the comments one by one. So by the time I get to... What's going on? It's not live anymore. Even my boy at work was telling me. But, um, uh, my guy at work was telling me, you know, but. Um, uh, he commented and he was waiting for me to answer, but, uh, I never did, you know. It's because I'm like 15 minutes behind. I really have to figure something out on how to stay up to date onto the chat. But that being said, do you golf? So, in terms of golf experience, just, I thought it would help with baseball and my dad also. So, we went to the driving range on a rainy day twice that was fun when i was like 15 years old and i think when i was 20 years old i did legit golf for the first time i didn't have gloves i teared up my hands by the seventh hole i wasn't really having fun but i had so much fun so much fun driving the cart i started driving it backwards and all that and yeah people were looking at me funny you should have filmed the youtube prank video uh crunchy eggs hi yo what's up crunchy eggs hope it's doing good haven't seen you around here um uh, welcome to the stream uh black cat 7217 what hours do you work from 2 p.m to 10 p.m but sometimes it overflows you know J, club fitting jobs available, 90 to 100k USD. I'm not too sure what club fitting is, I'm sorry. Harman saying, LCBO equals the Liquor Control Board of Ontario. Fun fact, it's the entity that sells the most alcohol on the planet. Hey, really? Really? Who knew? Oh, I think I went to an LCBO one time to get, um, uh, when I was in Toronto to watch baseball last year. And I got some kind of orange alcohol drink. And a lemon alcohol drink. And man, alcohol over here is so expensive compared to Japan. But what could you do? It was pretty good. It was the first time in a while that I had something like this. I might be I might be heading to Ontario to try a chicken sandwich that's been on my mind. And not next week, but the week after next. Uh, so a bit of logistics in the work, but it might turn into a long video. We might have a long video out in three weeks. Why I drive... Why drive 100 kilometers for this chicken sandwich? Maybe we could call it. I don't know. And uh, stay tuned if you're excited. I don't know. Uh, AJO, I'm lazy, says the guy who'd rather run 4K than spend $3. Whoa. To be fair, it was 6K. It was 4 miles. But that being said, that's beside the point. I think I'm more cheap than I am lazy. How to keep working out it'll help your stress. That's true. Like when I stop working out, I like it's weird. When I'm working out, I'm on a routine. I feel good. I feel energized all the time. But the second I stop working out, I just start feeling tired, weak. It feels like my body needs to move around, strengthening the muscles, you know, that sort of thing. Uh Danny Kilgore, Haman saying, Are you Canadian? Yo, Haman, Haman, I think he's from Montreal also, Danny. Maybe you two could link up for the poutine. I don't know. Gla oh, Gladys won. Okay, Gladys. Oh, I'm, I'm so behind on the chat right now. My bad. Yo, my bad. Okay, I'm going after rapid fire. Did he get fired or what happened? Gladys, to cut, this, to, cut to the chase, I didn't get fired today. Might have another meeting with my boss tomorrow. Might get fired tomorrow. I don't think so, but just to create some, you know, YouTube content drama, but, um, uh, no, I did not get fired today, I did not get fired, yeah, exactly, Mochi, he's not fired, he still has his job, uh, what happened, did he talk about his boss, <laughs> oh, no, I just lost the battery, no, bruh, now it looks like, uh, wait, here, let's, 
let's just lower the the batteries a bit. No, there's no saving. See, what I don't like about this light is how easy it goes out. You just use it for an hour and it's finished. But yeah, just to cut to the chase, you know, I don't know um, uh, who's, who's, if, if Gladys, you're still watching. If you are, basically to cut to the chase, you know, I get to work. My boss seems a bit like frustrated a bit sad yeah okay For, forget about the light i'm gonna we're gonna have to end the stream soon anyways like it may be in the next half an hour 32 a.m but to cut to the chase gladys i get to work you know my boss seems a bit like a bit like down you, you a bit frustrated hard to say when i asked her a question she went home we waited for the nighttime lady to come then me we we're like at a powwow fire stakeout if this was the phone me, my co-worker, and my other co-worker all huddled around this phone like it was some sort of fire. And then we call our boss and she basically tells us, you know, what we did at first was okay. But then like how we treated the second part wasn't good. This and that. We should have called her this and that. That and this. And then, you know, I started going on a whole thing just to the chat. Eh? Not to my boss. I'm just paid 40 cents more than the lowest paid workers there. And man, is it really worth all this extra stress having to do reports to staying the extra time for just 40 cents more? I don't even know anymore. But yeah, I didn't get fired. But um, at the end of the conversation with my boss, she asked us if we had questions. And I said, not today, maybe tomorrow. So... I might get a chance to talk to her in the office tomorrow and tackle some of my frustrations. But you know, I'm human too. And I like my boss. I like my job. And I know she's not responsible for deciding who gets paid what. And is it better if I... I'm trying to... I'll try, I have to try to find a good angle, you know? Because I feel like I'm sitting at the, the worst possible angle. Like this would this is probably gar a garbage angle, right? Yeah, this is pretty bad also. Alright, so th th we're going to know next time just not to go full blast mode on the, the light. But yeah, that being said, um, where was I? Yeah, that being said, you know, uh, I'm human too. I have compassion. I don't want to attack my boss for nothing. So uh, yeah, I'm not going to go too hard on her, but like, it's not normal. And if it's starting to feel unfair, the wage I'm getting for the work I'm putting in. And if I have the opportunity one-on-one -on -one, and my boss is like, is there something wrong? I'll close the door and say what I need to say. Probably leaving this job in the next two, two and a half months, something like that. Don't want to dump the gun or anything like that. But yeah, that's the situation. I did not get fired. AJ, Rice Bowl has made it. Getting some real random weirdos in the chat. Yo, you know you've made it when you on YouTube uh vertical live streams when you start getting spam and random random stuff in the chat. Gladys one, he's 90% rice, 10% Asian. Uh Momochi, bro, has a girl confirmed? Yo mom, yo mom. Do you identify with your Japanese side or your white side more? You know, on, I'm not going to lie, more of, more of my Japanese side because, you know, the media I consume, mostly in Japanese. The food I eat, mostly Japanese. And then, like, I don't really interact with, like, friends anymore. In my head, I think in, I think in English most of the time, not going to lie. But it's like, when I'm here, people, people just treat me as a full Asian person. When I'm in Japan, people treat me as a full Asian person. I never really get treated as, like, a white person. You know what I mean? So it's like, I kind of identify with my Japanese side a bit more. Momochi, your eyebrows are adorable. Hey, thank you so much. ML, hi, Rice Bowl. How's it going? Yo, not bad, ML. Hope you're doing well also. Jay, can we play Warzone together? Yo, once again, I don't know. I don't have a console. I don't have the I don't have the money or the funds. What's my battery percentage at? 73%. So the bad the phone came charged, but not the not the light, unfortunately. But uh yeah, I can't afford these consoles and all that, you know. Well, I can't afford it, but I don't want it like doesn't feel financially responsible. So I'm really not up to date with all the games. Gladys one, I didn't realize eyebrows had a personality, yo. These eyebrows are basically their own, their, their own sentient beings now. Momochi, Puzzle and Dragons is a vibe. Yo, you already know. You already know. Uh, Lero Teen, what's up? What's your account about? Yo, I'm probably, yo, Lero Teen is probably gone, but if you're not, welcome to the chat. Um, uh, welcome to the stream. We just talk about random stuff, audience interaction live. And other than that, you know, I make shorts about what I eat in a day and, you know, other fun stuff, talking about my life, voiceover, random cooking videos. So if you're interested, consider subscribing to the channel. The button's right there, but no one's forcing you to. Jimmy is on Hiru. 
No, Jimmy Zuni Uri. Where are you from? I'm from North America. How to? Are you going back to Japan? Hopefully in a couple of months. Gladys one, the eyebrows working a nine to five job. Jimmy Zuni Uri. Uh, what are your exact coordinates? Confidential. Harman Singh, as your neighbor, I agree with Emma. Keep it down. We all have to call. We all have to call the police on you. Yo, I don't have any neighbors though. Uh, Jimmy Zuni Uri, reset life. Momochi, bro, John, dry homie server. Gladys one, bro, no offense, but it's because you talk a lot about one topic. Like, it takes a whole 20 minutes. Yeah, that's the thing, you know? I just go on and on. But there's a reason why I do this, though, talking about one topic nonstop. Because if I just wrap it through the questions and then there's no more questions for me to answer. Look, there's not much for me to talk about either. I'm not some magic guy was, who could just come up with topics on the fly. So I kind of have to spread out the topics a bit to have a full two-hour stream. Or else, you know, the streams are going to be 15 minutes long and I'm going to have nothing to talk about and it's going to be over. So that's why when I say, like, when people leave comments, people talk about stuff in the chat. It's like... Helps me out, or else you know, the streams aren't possible. Uh, yo, mom, weird question, but do you budget? Like, how do you manage financials? Do you pay rent? No, nah, not really. Like, I live with my parents, right? So, what do I pay? I pay the gas, I fill up the car, right? And then when I go to the supermarket, I pay for that. Some Sometimes when my mom goes, she pays. Like, I'd say most of the time she goes, but you know, sometimes I go and I, I drop 250 here, 200 there. Uh, what else do I pay for? I buy random stuff for my parents here and there, do some Amazon orders. But other than that, you know, I don't pay rent. I don't have any huge expenses. Life is good living at home, but you know, this, this, it can't be like this for the rest of my life either. So it is what it is. It, it is what it is, but I'm grateful for this living situation. ML, glad to see a lot of folks join your live. Keep it up, Bull. Wish you all the best. Good night. Yo, okay. Hope you have a good night, ML. Thank you so much for watching. Jimmy Zunier, what's your nationality? Half Japanese, then we have like American, Canadian, all that stuff. Strong mind and body. Bro, yeah, positive vibes. Uh, here we go. Yeah, positive vibes. But I'm going to say something negative. The water boiler is um, uh, acting up once again. Jimmy Zunier, have you tried Popeyes twice? And I loved it so much. I might actually drive out 100 kilometers in two weekends just to try it again. Mr. Independent Variable, yo, what's up, yo? What's up, Mr. Independent Variable? Hope it's going well. Jimmy Zunior, have you tried Wendy's? Yo, you, there used to be a Wendy's nearby where I lived, actually, but then the McDonald's came. Well, I grew up eating McDonald's, and then when I had Wendy's for the first time, I was like, whoa, triple Esther situation. Can't go back. The fries are better. The, the chicken sandwich is better. The ice cream is better. The lemonade. Then, it was so clean inside, so quiet. I loved the place. But then uh, uh, McDonald's came right down the street, destroyed the Wendy's, and then I haven't been back since. Gladys one, maybe you shouldn't complain about what other commenters say. Eyes are a little so ironic. Uh, Momochi, can y'all chill? What's positive vibes only? Well, uh, yeah, I don't know. People could comment what they want, you know. Uh, Jimmy Zunier, what's your favorite type of rice? The, you know, Japanese short grain or medium grain, I'm not too sure. But yeah, that's my favorite type of rice. Uh, watch online. Light still fine without the battery. No worries. Yeah, I don't know. Without the batteries, I, it's like I look like a blueberry almost. I need to. I need to get the lights in action at some point. I'm gonna have to tone the the energy down on these, cause the light I had before, it lasts hours on end. But for some reason, how many milliamps is this? Two thousand. Oh well, there you go. Two thousand milliamp hours. It's nothing. Nothing impressive, you know. Man. Uh, Gladys one, no one hating, but they all go ahead and be deluded. I've been here all these lives, first time seeing you. Yeah, yo, it's true, it's true. Gladys one, Gladys one is not a hater, people. Gladys one, um, uh, Gladys one has been in all these lives. I appreciate, and everyone else is watching, you know, Momochi. We're having, um, a lot of people, a lot of the similar, you know, similar names. We also have, um, uh, Danny Kilgore, you know, Agio, you know, JC, I'm recognizing the names, you know, and I, you know, I, I appreciate it, I appreciate it, let's not, let's not get into any arguments, but, um, uh, yeah, let's not get into any arguments, you know, I'm not going to be toxic positivity, because that's not me, but let's try to avoid arguing if we don't need to. 
Uh, how do you look tired AF? You should sleep more, at least 10 hours. And yes, exercise gets rid of stress and other beneficial factors. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, I'm exhausted, but um, uh, on the YouTube grind, on the work grind, on the exercise grind, I'm on like three different grinds, the life grind, I'm on like four different grinds right now. Uh, maybe for the next two months and it should calm down a bit. How do you got a backup plan after you quit? Not really. So it's scary and exciting at the same time, you know, because I'm going to quit and then go back to Japan for maybe three months. I'm not sure. I'm And I don't think I'm going to be working, so I'm going to eat into my savings. I'm going to come back here, go back to school, work another job. But man, uh, it's exciting and scary at the same time. Uh, Jimmy Sr., do you like pizza? Yeah. I love pizza. I could probably eat it twice a week. And the other day, I went to this, like, wood fire pizza place. I had it fresh for the first time. When the people from the main office come to the factory I work at, they, they go crazy over this place because it's nearby, so they order it. And sometimes I open the box and I see it's, like, eight hours. They got it eight hours ago, and it's just sitting there. I'm like, bruh, this just doesn't look appetizing. But I had it warm for the first time. Just like the other day, four days ago, it's delicious. I'm gonna go again. Jimmy Zunior, are you Italian? Nah, I'm actually, I'm actually, um, uh, I'm actually Greek. Yeah, Momoji, it's 2 a.m., y'all. It's already 2.19. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna have to end the, the stream soon. I tried, I tried to start streaming early. Look, I know, I know it's a meme. Rice Bowl was the 3 a.m. streams, and, um, uh, don't get me wrong. I love doing the 3 a.m. streams, but it's late, you know? If I could start doing a stream at, like, 11, 11.30, it would be beautiful, but, um, uh, it's a bit, it's a bit tricky, like, because I procrastinate, I'm lazy. I'm getting a bit cold down here, I think I'm gonna have to exercise soon. So, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna rapid fire, oh, there's so many comments, thanks so much, guys. We're gonna, we're gonna rapid fire through the comments, and then probably end the stream right there. Um, tomorrow, you know, might get another, um, uh, meeting with my boss, who knows, can't promise much. Uh, will Rice Bowl get fired, part three, Asriv, to follow. Um... Toroturu Sanyama. Hi, Mr. Rice. Or, hi, Mr. My Sri Lankan bro. Yo, shout out to the Sri Lankan viewers. Danny Kilgo. Yo, Rice Boy looks like Joji. Yo, I don't know about Joji. People say I look like Mr. Bean and sound like... <laughs> sound like um, uh, Chris from Family Guy. But, yeah, Joji, uh, sometimes I get that. Uh, Christine, good night, Rice Boy. Have a great day at work tomorrow. Thank you so much, Christine. Have a good night also. Strong mind and body. Yo, I'm from Ottawa. Yo, do you guys have Arby's in Ottawa? Cause I might have to make the drive. Because I, I want to try Arby's again. It was so good. I love Arby's. Jimmy Zunier, have you played any Pokemon games? I played... Uh, what did I play? I played Pearl, Diamond, Platinum. I played Sapphire. I also played uh, Pokemon White. I played Pokemon X. I played Pokemon... or Sorry, Pokemon Y. Pokemon Soul Silver, which is my favorite. I also played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon and Pokemon um, uh, Omega and Alpha Sapphire. Alpha Sapphire. Jimmy Zunier, do you have a Pokemon card collection? Yes, but it's my old cards. I haven't really got into buying cards ever since the whole becoming an investment vehicle thing. Um, uh, how to, you should invest or find other ways to get money to buy a PS5 to play modern games, I don't know if I, I don't know, if I could, if I, if I could buy a console, I would buy a Nintendo Switch, I think, not really into PlayStation, not really into Xbox, not something I grew up with, but Nintendo, yo, Nintendo fanboy over here, love Mario Kart, love Pokemon, uh, maybe I could get into Zelda, Tetris, that kind of thing, we'll see. Verbo Puck 3 c 2 you look like you're from North Alaska. <laughs> um, d maybe I look a bit Inuit. It might be the eyebrows, might be the hair. I don't even know. Wonderland, hi, yo, what's up, Wonderland? Hope you're doing good. Harman Singh, if you go back to Popeyes, actually get the Cajun gravy poutine, best fat food poutine in the game. Okay, Harman, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to see my budget because I might stop at the LCBO also. I'm. Gonna get the chicken sandwich, I'll get the- I don't know if they're still doing the ghost pepper wings. Might get some Cajun fries. If I go with someone, I might tell them to get the poutine though. I might tell them to get the poutine. Hey yo, me trying to look like how he looks like a blueberry was out the light. 
Uh, yo, Garcia, yo. Fish, new sub. Don't you dare eat me. Nah, Fish, I won't eat you. Thanks so much for the sub, though. Uh, how to, you going to college? Nah, I graduated college way back a few years ago, you know? And college, I can't say much about it. I didn't really have that great much of a time there. I might have to go back, though. I might have to re-educate myself, but, uh... Yeah, first time around, it was not a nice true situation. <sighs> To the people who are like, whoa, college is the best time of your life. Nah, not for me. Lisa Fang, nice seeing you live for us, Paul. Have a good night. Greetings from California. Hey, have a good night. Lisa, see you in the next live. Fish, do you eat pancakes for breakfast? I have a video coming out very soon where I do eat pancakes in the, for breakfast, but not if my mom doesn't make them, you know? Uh, Mufasa1211, you look like you do something strange for some change. Nah, not for money. I ha I have dignity also. I, like, don't worry. I, I'm not going to drop my dignity for the dollar. Ian Bishi, please stop send, uh, please stop selling my son fentanyl. Yo, fentanyl is like something I would never get near. After my English teacher showed me that movie, Basketball Player's Diary, yo, I'd never even approach drugs as a 10-foot pole. Like, you see this pole right here? Like, I wouldn't even dare touch drugs with this. Illicit drugs, like, yeah, I'd take Advil or something like that, but, um, uh, yeah, that's just, that's the situation. Um, Mufasa one two one one. How much to fart in a jar and swallow? Nah, yo, I I I have dignity, as I was saying. Uh, Karina Schneider, do you have any dating advice? I have advice, but I don't know. It depends from what perspective you want it. You know, um, uh, for someone, where it's hard to explain, but yo, it's it's important. You know. I'm, it's all about, you know, finding someone to, for me personally, long-term relationship. You don't want to start wasting people's time, and, um, uh, I'm not interested in all this short-term stuff, and, um, uh, yeah, it just doesn't seem like a good use of my time. I already have limited hours in the day. I'm on the life grind, the, uh, the, the rice ball grind, the exercise grind, the streaming grind, the YouTube grind, the shorts grind. You know, I don't have time to, to jump around, you know, like that, so, um, uh, that's my dating advice for me personally. Just find something long-term. Someone who respects you. Like, if, like, my specs aren't that great if you think about it. Work in a bread factory, don't make much money. Like, don't make a lot of money. And I make YouTube videos as a hobby. And I exercise in my basement. That's all, and I practice the banjo. But hey, people, there's people out there who accept that, you know? Jimmy Zuni uh, it's 11.20 p.m. for me. It's 2.25 a.m. for me. Uh, the UK31, thank you again for another great stream. Good luck with the meeting, uh, Tomo. You got this. Oh, the meeting tomorrow, you got this. Yo, see you See you next time, the UK31. Uh, hey, Joe. Hello, Mr. Bean, I see a bit, tiny bit, but I don't see Chris from Family Guy, or I don't care Chris from Family Guy at all. It might be more into my old YouTube shorts when I used to, like, talk in a certain way to, you know, just grab the attention almost, but, um, uh, I've toned it down, maybe. Or, like, when I talk like this, man, stuff he knows, I don't know, but, uh, I used to get a lot of comments saying that I look like, or sound like Chris from Family Guy. April Luna, gotta go now, keep doing what you're doing, you're doing great, bye-bye, hey, thank you so much, April, see you in the next one. Uh, how to, you should try out Chick-fil-A. I, I tried going to a Chick-fil-A, where I was with my parents down in the States. We tried going, and it was uh, maybe eight years ago now, a long time ago. It feels like just yesterday, but you know, it was the whole pandemic and all that. It feels like life just fast-forwarded. This was like eight years ago, but it was a Sunday, and Chick-fil-A was closed. Hey, Joe, what's your main, who's your main in Mario Kart? In Mario Kart Wii, it's, um, uh, either, it's either, um, uh, Funky Kong, and in Mario Kart 8, it's, uh, what's his name? It's, um, uh, Shy Guy. Gladi1, what would you go back to major in? I don't know major, but I get some kind of certificate in cybersecurity. Something computer-related, I think. But, um, uh, right, yeah, exactly. Right now, I have a food science certificate. Uh, Harman Singh, at Karina Schneider, let me take you out to Arby's. Karina Schneider, hey Harman, what is Arby's? Yo, Arby's is an S tier situation, like, people hate on it a lot, but Arby's is like roast beef on, um, uh, on bread, you know? 
It's very cheap. I don't know how much it is now, but in back in the day, it's very cheap. The fries are like S tier. And, um, uh, yeah, that's the situation, you know? It's fast food. And it's very good. Uh, X, I'm, I'm starting to lose my voice. I'm going to have to end the stream soon, guys. My bad. So we're going to just have to rapid fire here, I think. <clears throat> I'm running out of water also. Uh, how to rice bowl? You should be a chef and get a restaurant. Yo, I don't know about like owning my real restaurant. What I like being about a cook is like you don't have to, you don't have to stress out over staffing. You don't have to stress out over the menu about the inventory. I just go in, just do what I need to do, and literally leave after. So you know, you just leave your work at the office and never get calls or anything like that. So I don't know about owning my own restaurant, but if I do down the line, it would probably be a food court place. Uh, Harman Singh, at Karina, well ordered the meat mountain. <laughs> Karina Schneider, I'm from Brazil, we don't have Arby's. Yo, shout out to the Brazilian viewers. And yeah, I'm not surprised you guys don't have Arby's in Brazil. Uh, Gladys won OMG, they don't have a Chick-fil-A in Canada. That's so sad, sorry, so, so sorry for your loss. I think they have it in, um, down in like, down out west right now. I'd have to make the drive. Stretty Racing, look at this Panda Express. <laughs> Yo, I haven't had Panda Express. The orange chicken looks pretty good, not gonna lie, but I've never had it. Oh, man, there's, um, uh, okay. Ra rapid, rapid fire questions, and then I'm gonna have to end the stream, I think, because I'm starting to really lose my voice. Um, uh, Momochi, I love King Boo. I never played Mario Kart 8. Yo, Mario Kart 8 is fun, but I do prefer Mario Kart, Mario Kart Wii, just because of the dr drifting. Yeah, yo, like, RP's, yo, for real, RP's is criminally underrated. Everyone comes after me, like, yo, you have bad taste in food, but yo, it's good stuff. Um, uh, Mohammed Ali Alkamesh, hi, yo, what's up, Mohammed? Hope you're doing good. Steady Racing, bro, are you at your aunt's basement? Nah, this is my parents' basement. Argun Retora, late, sorry, yo, Argun, yo. We're ending the stream here, though it's almost two thirty. But um, uh, thank you for thank you for tuning in. Yeah, I I want to try those Arby's curly fries again. Now uh, now you all are giving me ideas. X Y R dot I always joined your live streams when it was about to end. Yo, yeah, we're we're, we're going to end it soon. I think tomorrow or the day after tomorrow we might do a very long one. Right now I'm keeping them to around an hour and a half to two hours. Might try to do a four hour one soon, but um, uh, yeah, it doesn't help because like I'm quite tired and I'm losing my voice. But uh, one day at a time, you know, one day at a time. K A B Canadian or Japanese girl? Hey, no, both 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 are good. Both are good for me. Um, uh, I don't discriminate, you know, it doesn't even have to be Canadian or Japanese. Karina Schneider, oh, totally, I love Picanha. Bro, stop calling me Glad. my bad Gladys, my, my bad Gladys, sorry. Harman Singh, there's a Chick-fil-A in Toronto, Montreal people go to Plattsburgh for it. Yo, that's, that's the exact Chick-fil-A I tried to go to, but it was close. So we ended up going to the Harvey, uh, not the Harvey's, the Friendly's. How, how to set a timer at 2.35, you need to sleep, bro. Yo, 2.35, I need to sleep, bro, but I still need to exercise, you know. Yo, I still need to get through the resistance training, get in that cardio every day. So, um, uh, won't be sleeping yet, won't be sleeping yet. Patrick Connerton, will there be another stream tomorrow? Hopefully, I think there will, and the day after, and the day after that also. Argun Retour, I'm in school again, yo. If you have to concentrate on your classes, um, uh, it is what it is, you know. Just waiting for the bell to ring to start so we can leave. Uh, oh, so are you listening while the teacher's talking? Yo, be careful, don't get caught, please. Uh, Karina Schreider, you should rest. Yes, I need to, I, I do need to rest. Yo, Har Harmon's really shooting his shot. Good luck to Harmon and um, uh, Karina if they do meet up. Is there anywhere you want to be from Momochi? I want to be in Japan right now. It's so warm, you know. Uh, Karina Shanai is so fun. I hope you love it here like I do. Have you seen Brazil before? Um, uh, Momochi, I just don't get it.
Ajo, also Res. Can call you Gladdy, but not me. Fear, I'm not so handsome, yo. I don't know what that means, but um, uh, Gladys, Gladys. I'm deformed. Why do you want to stay? I don't know, like, I just, I, I don't know what you mean. Stay at your job, stay on the live stream. I don't know, but if you're talking about the live stream right now, you know, I just enjoy talking, you know, I have to, I have to let it out because if I started talking like this at work, people would be like, oh, what's going on? So I just have to continue talking, you know, talking and talking just to get it out of the system, just to tire me out a bit. How to? Trust me, it was my experience, sleep over, working out in late night situations, but don't hop off the grind, yo. Yo, uh, grind continues at least for the next few more months. Mohammed Ali Al Kamesh, what was the toughest part of your life? I don't know, I had a pretty, you know, smooth sailing. I guess the toughest part for me was, um, uh... A lot of these jobs I work, you know, you could say that they, they don't pay that well and it's very, um... I, but, you know, everyone, no one really works an easy job, but, you know, I don't know, I feel like these restaurant jobs, these factory jobs, you know, I do it to myself for applying to these types of places, but they're not easy and they don't pay that well, and, you know, it's a, it, it grinds you down day by day until you're, you're just left, just, you're, you're being held by a string, and before the string snaps, you know, I, I usually quit and save myself from just going totally, like, haywire, but, um, uh, yeah, it's a repeat, you know. Momochi, yo, bro, Rice is in his mid twenties. Yeah, like mid to mid to late twenties. You know, I don't know where the mid, mid and early twenty like, but you know, like mid late twenties. You know. Uh, did he just casually say I'm deformed? WTF? Nah, that was someone's username I was reading called I'm deformed. Uh, Karina Shana, Rice Boy, you should come to Brazil too. You would love the food. You know, I'd, I'd be down to try uh, Brazilian food. I want to try the, the steaks over there. I want the picanha, you know, like Guga foods. I also want to try the, the brigadeiros. I, 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 I don't know how to pronounce, but like the condensed milk, you know. Momochi, bro's answering to song lyrics. Yo, bro's getting exhausted, you know. Gladys Wonder, <laughs> Rice can call me potato. I wouldn't care. How to... God bless you, bro. Good night. Ah, okay, yo. See... So yeah, I think I'm going to um uh, end the stream very soon. And um uh, just want to thank everyone else. Everyone, we saw some new faces today in the chat. And I'm starting to get really tired. So I'm going to just have to do what I do. Eat some yogurt, exercise a bit, do some resistance training. <sighs> training for the knees. And then um uh, we're going to have to, I think we're going to call it a day here. Hopefully we could do longer streams. I'm just not used to doing these like very long streams. I don't know. I took a break from streaming. I want to get back into it. Doing it as daily as possible. And um, uh, as I say, it's thanks to everyone leaving comments, leaving stuff in the chat. And I'm able to continuously talk, try to attempt to try to be entertaining. And if it wasn't for that, you know, it would be, it would be a sad, sad stream. Tomorrow we might have another meeting with my boss. Hopefully it goes well. Will I get fired part three? I don't know. Two follow. I don't think I'm going to get fired. But but if I do, I'll let everyone know. I can't, I'm kind of inclined to um, skip the exercise today. But for dinner, I just had I just had an energy bar, fried rice, tomatoes, and fried chicken. So it would be good to use this protein that's in my body right now to build some muscle. So despite being tired, I'm going to try to do this, um, you know, still the grind. So I'm going to cut off now. It's 2.30. Start exercising at 3. And at 4. Rinse off. Bed by 5. I think that's going to be the name of the game tonight. So... Um, uh, that being said, that, that, that being said, thank you to everyone who watched today's stream. See you in the next one, wherever you are. Uh, see you in the next YouTube short. See you in the next stream. I don't know if anyone who's watching the streams right now is a first time viewer. Consider subscribing to the channel if you enjoyed today's stream. We'll try to get this battery working again, this light, so I don't look like a blueberry. And, um, uh, yes, that, and, yeah, for that being said, thank you to everyone who's watching. Depending on where you are in the world, it might be a good day, a hello, a goodbye. But I'm going to be signing off. See you in the next one. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, thank you for the comments. I had a lot of fun again. And, um, uh, tune in for the next one if you're interested. If not, a you have the free choice for that free will. I'm not going to force anyone to watch a rice ball stream. But that being said, uh, thank you for watching. See you in the next video or stream. And goodbye.